Who said she's so phony? Who's so phony? Who's so phony? Who's so phony? That's one thing I'm not. Okay. Hey, Qatar Bays, it's your girl Burpa going live with the Bree Talk and Bay Squad. We have to talk about Joe Budden siding with Cardi B. But before we get started, let's like, comment, and subscribe. Tap that notification bell so you can get all the updates and alerts. And remember, opinions are not fixed. Everything we say here is allegedly and for entertainment purposes solely. So sit back, relax, sip you some apple juice or my fifty finger water, and let's get into the mess, shall we? With anybody else, like that's that's just a, a very destructive type of energy that you would, I wouldn't have got that from her without meeting her. Like meeting her and hearing her story and it's like, oh, this is why you like this. It's like, oh, okay, this is why some things are maybe hindering your progress. Oh, this is why there's levels to this. The way you move and it's still kind of low, I don't want to say low level, but it's it's, uh, Low vibrational. Yes, yes, yeah, yes, yeah, a lot of that. So, not to not. Go ahead, Dash. So, aside aside from the legal standpoint, which is a huge standpoint, did her doing any of those clickbait videos with you and Melissa Ford's name in the titles have anything to do with it? Just a question. No, for I don't me. care about the videos. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we we. We had a really good interview. I understand why she why she's pissed about it not coming out. It was great. It was great. Like all around the board, it was great. But yeah, there was a lot of shit. Woo, Bay Squad, talk about divine timing. At the end of the day, I told y'all Joe Biden was scared. And then guess what happened? Bay Squad sends me this sound clip. Y'all gotta learn to stop talking all the S H I T in the back chats because it's gonna get you caught up every time. At the end of the day, you could say whatever you want, Joe Biden. It, you could you don't even have to put the interview out. But the fact you're trying to paint this narrative as if Tasha K is so unhinged, is she so mentally unsound? It's very weak of you, especially coming from a man who who drags Meg the Stallion every chance he gets, knowing she don't have a mother, father, granny, nobody. Just the industry and Mr. I'm not industry. But you're acting very industry at this point. I want to know what was said between you and Tasha. Okay, what went down in that interview to the point where you shook because of the spicy Latina? Because we know how you do. We know you love Amina, Amina, Bindaki. But, Bay Squad, how do y'all feel about this? Did this prove me right or wrong? Sound off below in the comments. Who would have thought Joe Buddy would be shaking in his boots? Spooked and nervous. Y'all, he better not ever speak on Eminem ever again. And on that note, comment down below. I gotta go. Bye, hoes.